Good morning, mountain bikers. I'm Chris Wessels, and you are watching MTB Trail Review. Today, we're going to talk about shoes again. And the reason we're talking about shoes again is because Etnies keeps upping their game, and I'm excited about it, and I want to share it because not only are their shoes awesome, they're very affordable. So today, we're going to talk about a couple of different ones here. I have the Camber Cranks and the Camber Crank Pros. I'm going to tell you which ones I like better. I'm going to tell you about the differences and uh, just talk about each shoe. Enjoy. So first off, I have tested each one of these, not extensively, but for a while. I've got a hundred miles roughly on each shoe and just checking the grip. I know that that's hard to see because it's cake and dirt, but it looks pretty similar to this. Um, they are both holding up very, very well. Let me see if this other one's cleaned off a little more. That's cleaned off a little bit better. So they're holding up very well as far as durability goes. They're both super comfortable. One of the things I really like about the Pro is it has this like built-in sock. So for me, I'm still gonna wear socks with it because I have the stickiest feet ever after I've been working out. I'd have to throw the shoes away immediately if I didn't wear socks, but it just adds a little extra layer of comfort. Um, the shoes feel a little bit more secure, which is nice. And even though it does have this, they still breathe pretty well, but they are a little bit warmer than these ones in my opinion. So depending on where you ride, that could be a good thing, that could be a bad thing. I also like the way that they design each of these. As you can see, these are a little bit more breathable. These are a little bit more weatherproof. and both are still super comfortable on the trail. Uh, the pros also have this little lace thingy holder, I don't know, where you tuck your laces in, that uh, will keep them from getting caught in your pedals, which I really, really like. I've been able to use these shoes in a variety of conditions, from snow, to some of the chunkiest trails, to jumps, to flow, basically anything you're going to encounter on a mountain bike. Throughout the rides, they've been very consistent, no matter the type of riding, no matter the terrain, no matter the weather. And above all else, they're still the most comfortable mountain bike shoes that I've worn. And somehow, with their newer models, they have gotten more comfortable. Now, I don't know how much that matters to you. Some people are all about how it sticks. Some people are all about how it feels on the pedal. But for me, comfort is paramount. I'm not racing. I'm out here to have fun. The shoes stick to the pedal. They feel good on the pedal and they are super, super comfortable. I don't know what else I could ask for. Wait, yes I do. Make them affordable. And Etnies has done that as well. Check out their website. It is very common, I have found, to find their shoes on sale. They retail for about the same price as most other high-end mountain bike shoes, but it is not hard to find them on sale. So check out the website, and there's a good chance that you will find a good deal. Also, just to be transparent, Etnies did send me these shoes to check out. That said, this is not a sponsored video, and all of my opinions are my own. I really do love these shoes. I hope you enjoyed this review. If you have any questions, leave them in the comments and I will do my best to answer them. As always, thank you for hitting the trails with me and I'll catch you guys on the next one.